everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with another bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces. Topic of the reading is, what is it that your person really loves about you? Is it your looks? Is it, their, is it your nature? What is it? What is that thing that, you know, that makes your person attracted towards you? Uh, we're going to tap into all of that. It can be for the person that you're currently dealing with. It can be a person that you have on your mind. And if you really want to know what do they love about you, let's find out. I will be adding uh, energy cards from your person as well in this reading. Plus, we will also be adding some messages from them as well. Uh, we might add some charms as well. So stay tuned. And uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you. It is a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there, so always pick the signs and messages that resonate and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see, Pisces, what is it that they love about you? What is that? They love the way you are. you keep sharing your heart out to them. They love the way you are expressive. They love the way you are like you know always open to share your heart out to them, share the good news that you have to share with them. You always prioritize your person, and this is the first thing that they love about you. Uh, for some of you, you could also be a public figure or something like that, and which also you know makes your person feel very proud of you as well. So there is a lot that they admire, love about you. It's not just one thing. It's just the way you are, which excites them, which brings them a lot of happiness and joy to be, uh, you know, uh, the one for you. Um, this person also loves the fact that you're very joyful. Let's see more cards here. What else do they love about you? Um, I feel like, you know, ev ever since you came into their life, this person really believes that their love has, uh, their life has changed forever. Um, I feel like, you know, um, they might have been struggling with so many delays in their life before you entered in their life. And ever since you came into their life, they also started feeling like, you know, they have become lucky. So they do see you as their good luck charm as well. They have been uh, having some unexpected bounties coming their way as well. If they are into business, their business flourished ever since you came into their life. You have been a good luck sign for them. They might have bought a new car, new house after you entered there in their life. And I feel like, you know, this person really uh, connects that to you because they feel that you are lucky. You have been lucky for them since forever. So they do admire that about you as well. Um, then we have... Um, they really believe that the connection that they have with you is magical, something that they never experienced with anyone else in this world. Uh, they do admire you for that as well because uh, they believe that you have been wishing, hoping, praying for them as well. Like, you know, whatever concern they have about whatever area of their life, you always uh, pray around it. You always uh, make sure that their worries are taken away. So you are that magical genie that they have in their life as well who helps them get rid of all the blocks um, that they are having in their life. So they do see you as somebody who is um, nothing less than, um, than a magical uh, you know, being who solve their issues, problems like anything. Let's see more cards here. What else do they think about you? Um, or what else do they love about you? They do see you as somebody who's very protective. So again, this is something that they love. Now, they also like the way you are in terms of um, the, the kindness that you show to people, the kindness that you show to the nature, the kind of uh, love and, uh, um, you know, connection that you have from within. Uh, towards the God that you believe in, towards the nature, towards the spirit, guys. It's it's something like the divine nature that you have. That is also something uh, you know, as, you know, inspiring for them. Uh, you know, being with you is something that has made them kind of you know, um, got into um, you know, um, involved into the things or the acts of kindness. Like you know, they might have started doing the charity work, donations, and everything ever since you came into your into their life. So I do see that this person really has changed a lot. Uh, they might have been like you know rude, rigid, arrogant, but ever since you came into their life, things have changed for them. They have become more grounded. They have become more uh, you know they they do see you as your grounding force is what I'm picking up. Underneath the deck we do have um, wow. 
you have helped them to get rid of some addictions that they were having. Now that is something beautiful. That is something beautiful. Um, they, they, they believe that you have pull, uh, pulled them out of something that was not good for them. And it can be sex addictions, it can be other addictions, it can be smoking, it can be something else that they were addicted to and they believe that you have helped them to come out of it. So there is again something beautiful that they have for you. Um, let's see, what else uh, do they love about you? Let's see, what else do they love about you? What else do they love about you? What else do they love about you? Four of Cups, wow. Four of Wands, the Hangman, wow. You know, this is the best thing that they love about you. I feel like, you know, um, with all the delays that have been happening in your connection with this person, you have always sticked around. You have always waited for this person. You might have been having some offers coming your way, but you never chose to give in to any connection. You never chose to accept any offer. They really believe that you are somebody who is very dedicated to them, who believe that, you know, it's, it's more like the, the sense of uh, a belonging that you have for this person is something that they love about you as well. They know that if you wanted, you could have moved on, but they never saw you moving on from them. In the tough times as well, you chose to stick around with this person, and this is something that they love the most about you. The sense of belonging that you have for this person is also one of the reasons why they want to see their future with you, because um, they might have struggled a lot being with you in their personal life as well, but at the same time, you are that one person in their life who they um, believe would never give up on them. Even if they are having their toughest time in their life, they belong, uh, they, they know that you belong to them and you are going to be, you know, sticking around for them. You're not going to leave them for anybody else or you're not going to leave them for not having, uh, you know, enough um, luxuries in their life. I feel like, you know, they, 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 they see your heart connected to theirs forever. And I feel like you know, that is also one of the things that they love the most about you. Um, let's see, uh, what is it that they're currently feeling about you? What is it that they're currently feeling about you? What is it that they're currently feeling about you? What is it that they're currently feeling about you? Four of Swords, Queen of Swords, Ace of Wands, and in the deck we do have the Three of Pentacles. I feel like you know this person could be our you know right now maybe in not in happy communication with you right now, but they believe that um, they can trust you for again for the same reason. Uh, maybe you are having a tough time with this person right now, but they believe that you're not gonna. Um, you're just gonna stick around for them, and they are you know they really want you to know that um, no matter what happens, they trust you. Even if they are being told that you maybe you have done this and that in their absence, they are not going to listen to anyone. I feel like, you know, um, there there are people in their life who are trying to control them, uh, trying to kind of, you know, make them pursue something else or someone else, but they are not going to do that because they are obviously thinking about you and only you. And I feel like, you know, they do have people in their life who want to control them, uh, manipulate them, but um, I feel like, you know, they have their heart, um, you know, um, protected their love protected for you and only you um this person has um has been thinking a lot about what has been happening in their personal life and their other areas of their life maybe for some of you you are in no communication with this person right now they might be busy with their work success and everything but um trust me nothing is satisfying them as much as they are feeling satisfied being with you so they might be like you know if you are in no communication they will be coming to communicate to you because that's what they want that's their that that feels like home to them when they are connected to you when they are talking to you so they really want you to know that as well let's see some messages coming from your person now let's see what do they wish to say here i feel like you know there are people in their life who are controlling them who are keeping the two of you apart right now but they know that you are gonna stick around I got scared of the commitment, so I left. For some of you, maybe the person that you're dealing with was uh, scared of commitment back in times. So they might have left you that time. But they know that, you know, whether they commit or you, they don't, you're still going to be sticking around to them. I need more time to think through and figure things out for myself. This person really wants you to know that they love you. and uh, But they really 
have fears of commitment right now. Maybe they are invested into something else. So they need something, you know, more, some more time for, for, for themselves. I am a better person because of you. Right now, this person really gives you the credit of uh, who they are right now. I feel like they have matured up a lot and uh, they, they value you for being there for them as well, for being the, the guiding light for them. I have to pull away for now. I feel like you know, for some of you, your person might have stopped talking to you because, uh, because of uh, the people in, in their life right now. It can be their family, it can be their work, but there is something which has kept the two of you apart for now. But um, you are my sacred home to me. This person really believes that you are that one person who makes them feel alive so right now if they are not talking to you or if you are not talking terms right now trust me this person is really 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 missing you and they are not at all happy without you so i really feel like you know there is a lot um that that this person is thinking and feeling about you right now let's see the charms let's see what the charms has to add what the charms has to add to the read so we do have 12 bits which is r and L, it could be your name, initial name, initial of the person that you are dealing with. I feel like, you know, your person could be very busy um, making some tough decisions in regards to their work right now, regards to their money matters right now. December could have been a significant month in, in regards to your connection overall. Or the coming December will be a significant time for the two of you. Uh, you might be traveling to see each other if you are not in the same country or city. Um, I feel like, you know, things are going to change in the favor for this connection and for the two of you. There is some sort of travel involved here. Maybe you are traveling away from them. They are traveling away from you right now. But they are not happy with the whole situation. They really want to be back with you. They love you so much. And uh, for some of you, you might be traveling around the world because of their work. Maybe they are the ones. Maybe you are the one. But yes, I feel like, you know, um, they want you to know that they love you now, today, tomorrow, and always. Uh, no matter where they are, but their heart is always beating for you. You light their life, you light them up, and they really want you to know that um, they do play some music which reminds them of you. You are the queen of their hearts or king of their hearts, and this is what they want you to know. I feel like, you know, there's a lot of love here in this connection, and I feel like, you know, this person... Uh, really believe see you as somebody who's a very matured up person uh, not not the age wise but the way you deal with things are something you know um, they admire you for as well so yeah that's uh, pretty much it for this read if it was of help uh, do like share and subscribe and if you are willing to purchase any of the services uh, that I offer check the description box for that till I do the next read for you guys take care bye